The following is a presentation of the Eagles Sports Network. College athletics is a wonderful place to see young people mature. A prime example of that is senior right guard Robbie Ignani. When Ignani first arrived on Carson Newman's campus, it seemed improbable that he would carry the banner for the offensive line. But now Ignani embraces the leadership role. Well, I just watched uh, how they were an example, like how they were out on the field. Um, I learned a lot from Kevin, Lucas. Those guys taught me a lot about how to keep my head level out on the field. Uh, Alex taught me how to be smart. Offensive coordinator Mike Turner believes that Ignani's struggles has helped him to grow as a human being and a leader on the team. You know, I heard Coach Sparks many times, they forget about those scoreboards, and I, gosh, of all the kids I've coached, I can't tell you the, the scores of games and things like that, but I can tell you stories about those guys, how they've grown up, where they came from, how they've grown up, uh, what's happened in their lives since they've been here. Uh, that's the rewarding part. That's why you do it. That's a part of your, your ministry, what it's about. And uh, I, I think you're doing what God wants you to do, and that's to grow up young people, and that's to uh, hopefully show them a way that's going to lead them in the right direction. Young players always look for someone to show them the way. Junior quarterback DeAndre Thomas has grown as a person thanks to the example of the offensive line. Coming in my freshman year, I didn't really say much, but watching the offensive line and watching him as like a big guy during the summer, like he, like just to see big guys like that going out there running full speed, running hard, giving their all, is just, it's just great to see and it makes you want, want to go hard as a player. And as uh, far as Carson Newman way, he, he's doing it the right way and it's, it's a great guy to look up to the, um, to learn from. Turner said that there was probably a time when Ignani didn't want to be a leader, but he stepped up when his time came. Uh, I think at one time earlier in his career, he wouldn't want any part of that. But he's uh, come along into that part into where he's uh, uh, not only a, a leader in some ways, but he, he's the role model type for some of those kids. And uh, Robbie's had some struggles in his life, and he's, uh, he's learned to overcome many, many of those. And I'm very, very proud of his growth and his maturity. Uh, he's a very uh, fiery type player, very explosive type player. That's what makes him special as an offensive lineman. Uh, and he just continues to get better there. And, he, and he's, he's learned to understand what it is to be in the situation that he's in, what opportunities he has. But his passion for the game is, uh, you know, unquestioned. And his desire to be great at it is unquestioned. His work ethic is great. So he's what you're looking for. Ignani has a degree in psychology and is currently working on his MBA. He had a chance to call it quits, but he wants his teammates to understand why he decided to play one more season in Mossy Creek. I just want everybody to, uh, to know that I was looking out for them, uh, to know that, uh, that I was always working for them, and that uh, basically the only reason I'm even playing my fifth year is because I love these guys. I mean, I could have just kept on going with uh, like what everybody else has to do after they graduate. I mean, I have my degree, but I just decided to play with these boys one more time and NFL, whatever, that's cool. But I already told these guys, it's really all about them. So I love them. So I hope that everybody loves me back, I guess. Turner gave the highest of praises to Ignani. The veteran offensive mastermind knows most kids are not thinking five years into the future. With everything Ignani has gone through, Turner believes that the senior is ready for whatever the next chapter of his life brings. For the Ken Sparks Show, I'm Michael Watray.